Hello, this is Hamid and in this session I'm gonna teach you how to set up um, side-to-side VPN in 48 devices. So as you can see here we have two 48 devices and they're connected together via port 2 and port 3 and we have two uh, systems that they are connected directly to 48. Uh, uh, I can manage Fornicate through port 1 and the, the, the local interface here is the 192.168.20.1 uh, for a port 1 and here is 10.1. So what I'm gonna do, I connect to Fornicate 1 and set up the side-to-side uh, -side VPN from the this uh, uh, PC that's Kali Linux 1. And the Kali Linux one uh, is here. So, and the IP address that I'm connecting now is 21. So that's correct. And here you just go to IPsec wizard and in IPsec wizard, right here, the side one, the name side one, I select the template side to side, the remote device type 40 gate, I don't have any NAT, so I select the no NAT between sides. Here, that's so tricky because it's asking you the remote device and the remote device is here 10, 10, 10, 2. So I enter the IP address 10, 10, 10, 2. So it automatically detect the outgoing interface. So uh, it says that the outgoing interface is port 2. So that's correct. The outgoing interface is port 2. And I select the pre-share key here. If you have a certificate you can use the signature and then next here uh, is your policy and routing so my local interface here is port 1 and the local subnet is 20 zero that's right and the remote subnet remote subnet here is 10 one nine two one one six eight ten uh, zero slash twenty four and I don't have an internet access I don't need internet access here uh, if you need an internet access you can use the share local or use remote and then I just click on create uh, in some reason uh, we don't we have a duplicate name so I have to add another one so I create the site one that FG one and I repeat the same scenario My IP address remove 10 10 10 2 10 10 10 2 Outgoing interface 2, share key, pre-share key, and my local interface, port 1, here, 192.168.10.0 slash 24, and then I press create, here you go, perfect, and then, I mirror the configuration in the site in 40 gate 2 so here I can go to Kali Linux 2 and username is admin so I have the same scenario here Just go to VPN and here we have IPsec wizard. 
so again I am saying that this one is side 2 FG2 and side to side for the gate known at next again here is asking me to remove the IP address so the remote IP address is gonna be 10 10 10 1 and outgoing port 3 let me check that it is port 3 right it's correct and pre-share key is should be the same as uh, side 1 so next your local interface if you look at the uh, diagram here the local interface is port 1 so port 1 and 10 0 that's correct and 0 and the remote side is going to be 20 0 slash 24 and press create perfect now the next step is uh, to go to monitor and ipsec monitor and here you see that that the the side is down just right click and bring it up so now the uh, 10 10 10 1 interface is up so I do the same thing in Kali 1 so I go to monitor and IPsec monitor so you see that here is automatically is up if you look at the logs and reports here VPN event uh, you can see the VPN event so the phase one succeed and the phase two is the status of success so now let's ping from this side side one to side two to see that can I ping 192.168.20 uh, sorry 10 2 yeah because uh, the other side is 10 2 now let's try in Kali 2 this Kali 2 and what I'm gonna do here I do I uh, ping 21 so I think 192.168.22 so the ping is successful it means that I have a ping from the tunnel to from the side 1 to side 2 I hope this has been informative and thank you for watching